Volume 1 of the Chainsaw Man anime released last week in Japan, and its sales figures for the first week ain't looking too spicy. This was a surprise for sure, considering how popular it has been, at least in the West, which is why I wanted to make a video on it for those of you who don't follow me on Twitter. The combined Blu-ray and DVD sales are approximately 1,735 copies, which really isn't a great figure, considering this show was supposed to be the anime of the century and truly the anime of all time. According to some at least. Chainsaw Man has even sold less than a certain scientific accelerator's first week back in 2019, for example. And that was a spin-off, not even the main series in its franchise. And nor is it the most popular spin-off Toaru has to offer. That's a big oof. But why has Chainsaw Man tanked this hard? Well, despite its popularity, it has seen some hardcore fans of the manga voice their distaste aimed at aspects of the adaptation in addition to the CGI animation. Although, I'm just a pathetic anime only, so I can't really comment on the adaptation itself. In terms of the CGI though, it's definitely not the worst thing I've ever seen. Like, Chainsaw Man never went to Berserk 2016 levels of visual diarrhea, so I don't know if some people are just entitled and unrealistically want ufotable levels of animation in their favourite series, and us Toaru fans had to cope with Index 3. Ugh. I mean, I'm not the biggest fan of CGI animation, but I don't think this is worth having a fit over. Still, I find it pretty goddamn funny that Chainsaw Man is doing this bad over in Glorious Nippon. But it will be interesting to see if it does well once it releases in the West. It could also be because physical media has been on the decline for years now, but I still think that's not really an excuse, when the Accelerator anime had to deal with that too. And to be fair, it is just the first week, so who knows, it could get better or worse, depending if you're a glass half full or half empty kind of person. Let me know down below what you think about this, and thank you for watching.